So let's set up a clip just with the kick drum maybe for example. So my kick drum is on channel one. So I just put in a four to the floor beat here. And that's sounding pretty crappy. So I'm gonna use this uh, preset here to send all those parameters here to my Cork Volker drum. So I have two different options to um, send or to shoot what I called here um, the different parameters or the different values here to my Cork Volker drum. I can shoot the current, which will be only the selected drum part here. So if I select one, it will shoot only the current parts here. And now those parts are being sent to my Cork Volker drum. Or I could select all parts and now all parts. So one, two, up to six, all those different parameters here, seen here, are being sent to my Cork Volker drum and changed accordingly. So now I can have a listen to the kick drum. Let's start this click. And a nice kick drum, a bit flunchy here. And I can start editing all the different values here. So the level or the pitch of the kick drum. And this applies obviously to all the parameters you are seeing here. So you have one option here in the editing, you can actually um, have the two different parts being selected um, together by one wheel. So for example, if I get the volume here, the level, for part uh, layer one and layer two. And if I want to control those just by one knob, I can tick this box here and the second wheel here for le level on layer two is grayed out and I can only access this um, first one on the layer one here and the one on the layer two will change as well.